How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Videos. Today I want to show you how to download a magazine on the Kindle Fire and just kind of what it looks like. Uh, so let's jump right in, come to the upper left corner, click on Newsstand. And we want to come to the upper right now and click on Store. And um, so what's cool here is uh, we got, you know, free magazine or featured magazine, excuse me, not free, featured. You get different topics, fashion, men's interests, cooking, all kind of stuff like that, finance. And then up here we have a section where there's uh, some 90-day uh, free trial magazines you can try out. This is really cool because then you don't have to necessarily pay up front, but you can kind of see what you like, what you don't like. I am going to, which magazine should I pick? I'm going to click, um, let's go with, uh, Let's see Bon Appetit. That sounds pretty cool. I love to eat, so that's not a hard one for me. So, uh, right here it shows you the subscription prices uh, for a month, $2. If you want to just buy this issue, it's $5. And it says subscribe, but under subscribe, it says free 90-day trial. So, if you hit subscribe now, don't worry. It's not going to uh, charge you. We'll just hit subscribe. And... Um, now it's going to download it. So you don't have to worry. You can, you know, again, try it out. Look at it. See if you like it. See if you're interested. And if so, then maybe you want to, you know, come back later and then download the, you know, the full thing, the full subscription or whatever. So it's downloading. Let's give it a second. And let's see what these magazines look like. All right. Five, four, three, two, one. Zero, negative one, negative two, negative three. Forgive me, I'm just being silly here while this thing downloads, but it looks like it's almost done. So that's awesome. All right, let's click on read now. And there it is. And so this is cool. We have the front cover right here. And that was my phone going off. Sorry about that. We have the front cover, and we can just swipe for uh, each page or we can just tap the center of the screen and then this little cover option comes up but we can actually um, kind of look through and see what all the pages look like and maybe you want to jump right to the recipes or or maybe a page jumps out and looks cool you can just swipe right through it and let's stop at this with a citrus something and then tap the center of the screen for that to go away and then we can read the article let's see we can pinch to zoom so that's cool we want to get in a little bit closer. We can let's make it like that. We can also um, got menu right here, so you can actually look through. This is a, another kind of cool view to see what the featured articles are in the magazine. We can see um, a couple of different other options: starter, uh, more columns. So, a couple different options. There's a text view as well. And that didn't seem to do anything. I thought that was going to change something. I guess that doesn't really. Anyway, let's go ahead and go back. By hitting the back arrow. We're going to hit it again. Okay. And tap here. And we can just scroll through. But this is cool, though. Because you can look at every page of the magazine. And then if something jumps out, like wherever that is, that looks good. This is, let's tap the screen, let's zoom in, because we want to see the article. The Soul, I can't pronounce that, sorry, don't judge me. Um, but this is cool, maybe you want to jump right to the recipes and you don't want to like have to look at the advertisements or anything. You can just go ahead and just pinch to zoom, and all kind of cool stuff. These back ones aren't looking as advertising, but that's okay. And then a couple articles in the back there. But, I mean, that's it. That's it in a nutshell. Um, let's see if we tap the center. Come back through here. Or you can use this little guy at the bottom. You can kind of move a little faster. But this is what a magazine looks like on the Kindle Fire. So you can, again, just swipe. You don't have to use a stylus. I use it because it just keeps my screen a little bit cleaner. But we can just go ahead and swipe with your finger. Except if you're on the back page like I was. Idiot. But we can just kind of go through, and then we can stop if we... Uh-oh, that looks good. What is that? Two hands. 
I think that's a souffle. Forgive me if it's not. You know, I just eat it. I don't know the names of all the foods. But this is kind of a cool thing that we can just use to, we can even go slow. Ooh, deli. There we go. So, I'm sure, you know, if you, if you have some favorite magazines out there, they're converting a lot of them over so that they're compatible with the Kindle Fire. So, um, if you want to search a magazine, let's go all the way back. Let's see. Uh-oh. Maybe I should just go. It's a good question. How do we get back to the store? It's actually already got us into the magazine, so we need to hit back all the way. There we go. So that's that magazine. We can go up here and in, in uh, where it says search newsstand store, and let's type in. I'm not sure if they still have Chet magazine. No, they don't. I am very old. Forgive me. Uh, what's the magazine we could search? There's better homes. Better Homes and Garden. Let's go ahead and click on that. Let's see what comes up. And that's a free subscription. That's a free one. All right, let's tap on that. Let's see what, I love free stuff. You know me. Let's click on free. Oh, this is actually an app. This wasn't, some, this is one thing I noticed. Some of the magazines are apps. They're not, um, like, I guess you could say a book, or it would be in the apps, not in your magazine section or your newsstand section, which is totally okay. Um, it just means that when you go to read it, you'll go to apps instead of going to a uh, newsstand. But here it's ready. Let's go ahead and open it up. And let's see what it looks like. The reason they make them into apps sometimes is so they, they can add different functionality. Um, so it's not just like reading a book, but that you can get more interactive like the last one There was that little search at the bottom that you could use to to go through the magazine like this one doesn't have that search Because it's a little bit different. So let's go to better homes Library so this is a little bit different. I'm not feeling this as much But you know to each their own you might like it uh, For some reason it's not loading. So I'm just gonna go go back and close that Let's actually go to our home screen here. And so if we go to apps, let's see. See Better Homes is now in our app section. But if I go back to the home button and now I go to newsstand, Better Homes isn't in there. So that's one thing you have to notice. Um, certain magazines, when you download them or you try them, um, they're going to download as an app and not always as uh, something in your newsstand. So just keep that in mind. So that's kind of just a little brief um, overview of what magazines looks like, how to download them, what they look like on the uh, Kindle Fire. And I uh, hope that was helpful. And get out there and download some magazines and just take full advantage. Kindle Fire does so much, so don't limit it to just uh, book reading. All right, have a good one.